that is it. We are down here at the Moose Mountain Bike Trail Society. First event of the year. We have this classic skid contest going on behind us. And uh, burgers, non-alcoholic beer provided by Bandit P. And just an all-around good atmosphere. So let's see what some uh, people can do. So we're here with Tarsh, we're going to do a bike check on what looks like a really nice Weir 1. That's right, this is my 2022 Weir 1 arrival, 160 in the front, 153 in the rear. Um, I've had this bike for a year now and I really, really like it. Responsive, jibby bike, super fun. So I got the... Uh, Factory Fox 36 in the front. Nice. I got the EXT coil going in the Astoria coil going in the back. This is a new okay. purchase from one of my homies, recommended it highly. Um, running race face aluminum cranks and steel cranks, sorry. And um, we got Shimano Saint brakes. Mixing with some SRAM drivetrain, it looks like. SRAM drivetrain. Yeah. Uh, I got my I got my DHR2 in the rear and my Asagai in the front. What might be left of it a little bit? That's right. Yeah, it's looking well worn. Real fast roller right now. Good skitter. Yep. Exactly. Yeah. But, yeah. Uh, <laughs> double barrel. Double barrel bangers. Amazing. Yep. Great bike and uh, purchased from. The inside line, best bike shop in Calgary. So go there, check it out. They got lots of them. Excellent representation. Favorite piece, favorite components. What do you like the most? Uh, it's. I gotta say, my two favorite components are my Saint brakes and this mm. new Astoria coil shock. Feels great. Fair enough. Supple and yeah. Keeps me on the ground. Any uh, upgrades planned in the future? Uh, no, I'm gonna ride this bike out, um, and then I may investigate the. Uh, earlier 170 travel mm, edition yeah. of the arrival. Absolutely. Oh, no, that's wicked. Awesome. Well, thanks very much. Appreciate it. Nice yep. to meet you. Yeah, nice Absolutely. to meet you too. Thank yeah. you. Going to do a bike check on actually what is this it is a chromag root down okay okay and how long have you had it uh well this is the second frame so i've had this okay. since 2022 yeah uh yeah it's been a good little ride. 38 or six up front 36 36 nice so what was the goal for the build i mean going hardtail is it uh simplicity simplicity yep yeah uh keep it simple no suspension to wear out. Uh, <laughs> keeps you honest to so the skill building aspect of it. Fair enough. And uh, yeah, just get lots of miles on it. Have fun. Nice. Riding nice. a simple rig. This does it all. So bike parks out here uh, on the uh, M Moose Mountain Trails. Um, some cross country, you know, Beautiful. take it everywhere. So what's uh, what would be your favorite part of the bike? Or favorite component? The or? favorite component? Probably the fork. Okay. Yeah. 36 just works well. Yeah. It's uh, stood the test of time and yeah, gets the job done. Fair enough. And uh, followed closely by the leather seat. I, I mean, the brown leather is it's just, it looks right. I feel like we should talk about the smell of rich mahogany in context right? of that seat. I mean, you <laughs> might not want to smell that one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's got a few miles on it. But. Fair enough. But what do we have for a uh, rear hub here, actually? Rear hub, uh, Hope Hubs. Hope. Oh, okay. They're original to the 
bike. Front and back? Yeah. Yep. Right. Yeah. Again, just reliability. They're the sure. most solid, affordable hub I've found. So fair enough. They're killing it. Any uh, upgrades or changes planned? Uh, the only thing would be swapping to Race Face's latest ERAs oh, and yeah. when these wheels die, maybe a 2.9er upgrade. Oh, okay. okay. Was that 2.6, I think? 2.8. 2.8. 2.8. So yeah. the idea there um, is I can throw 3.0 studs on this in the winter and it's a year round bike, which in a four season climate yeah. is perfect. That's for wicked. this area. Plus, um, I guess with a hard tail, you get maybe a little bit of. Uh, you know, dampening out of the, the tires a little bit? Or? Yes. Yeah. That was the, yeah, absolutely. I forgot about that detail. Um, 100%. These do soak up a little bit of the chatter on the trail. Wicked. So, wicked. Yeah. Nice. Cool, man. It's a sweet ride. So, yeah. Appreciate Thank you taking the time to chat about it. Absolutely. Thank you as well. Thank you. So that's it from uh, out here at the uh, first event for the Moose Mountain Bike Trail Society. I'd like to thank you very much for tuning in. Just kind of a shorter, fun video for today. But uh, I'm really going to try to make a point to uh, you know, involve myself in this community as much as I can this year. So um, if you like this type of content, let me know. Greatly appreciate it. If you like what we're doing here, um, you know, I always appreciate a like. And uh, if you are interested in the Scouting the West series, which is coming up, then be sure to subscribe. In the meantime, thank you very much for watching. I really do sincerely appreciate it. You take care and bye for now.